Well, here we are at the S190. It's at the, um, I would say, upstream end of the L28 interceptor. It's an 18 mile long canal uh, levied on both sides, as you can see, uh, that goes south from here. Um, really side skirts the Big Cypress, um, forming its uh, eastern boundary with the Everglades. And then all that water dumps out into the uh, Water Conservation Area 3A, and it's uh, a big part uh, of uh, um, the Everglades uh, Restoration Initiative is to arrest that flow and clean this water because it's contributed to this big nutrient or vegetation plume 18 miles south of here. Um, this is the dry season, so right now those gates are closed and it's actually backing up water, storing water to the north um, for water supply purposes um, and just uh, to have that water saved here to the north um, and through the west feeder and the north feeder through the um, Big Cypress Seminole Indian Reservation. Um, on the tailwater side during this tail, uh, low water condition the water table is actually the same height as it is 18 miles to the south practically. So what that shows is that even though this canal is levied on both sides, seemingly kind of side skirting the cypress, during the dry season, the canal actually drains the cypress swamp, the adjacent cypress swamp, from below. And that amplifies the depth of the drought, making the swamp more vulnerable to wildfires when they occur. Thanks for watching.